Vlogs. I'm Kenna. And I'm Maya. And this is your Halloween newscast. Next Monday is Mix It Up Day. What's that? It's whenever you receive a card when you walk into the lunchroom and you have to sit with the people who have the same card as you. That sounds fun. Let's go to an interview with a Paw Squad member to find out more about Mix It Up Day. What is Mix It Up Monday? Um, Mix It Up Monday is to get people out of their comfort zones and to make new friends. Are you excited about Mix It Up Monday? Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. I really want to go trick-or-treating, but I don't know what time I can go. You can trick-or-treat from 5.30 to 8.30, but don't stay out past 8.30. Hey, Kenna, I heard there's a BTV Halloween show at Starlight Drive-In this weekend. Yeah. Come support your fellow Bulldogs at Tales of Terror at 6.30. Now That's to your Bulldog, Bulldog feature. Hey, hey Bulldogs. Bulldogs! I'm Addie. And I'm Maddie. And, and this, this is your Bulldog feature. This Tuesday is Halloween. What are you going to dress up as? I'm going to be a phone app. What about you? I'm going to be a burglar. Sounds fun. Speaking of trick-or-treating, let's go to some safety tips with Jabril. Hey guys, it's Jabril, and I'm here to tell you about some safety tips you'll need for Halloween. Safety tip number one, don't talk to strangers. What's your name? I'm Jabril. You want some candy? Yeah. Follow me. Alright. Safety tip number two, make sure you wear your helmet. That's why you need a helmet. Tip, don't eat too much candy. Oh, and remember, don't poke the bear. Thanks, Jabril. Congratulations to all the films that placed in Peace in the Streets. Out of the 10 middle school place winners, BTV got five of them. We got a second place with Body Shaming by me, Madeline Rhodes, and Maya Anderson Corns, and fourth place with Why Hate by Jackson Crenshaw and Grace Weiler. We also got three honorable mentions. Remembering John's Vision by Melissa Mahaffey and Riley Morris. Choose Kind by Sydney Goodlett, Gavin George, and Will Adams. And Reach Out for Peace by Amy Pesky. Did you hear we're going to see Wonder in theaters? Yeah, I'm really excited. We're going on November 30th. Permission slips are due today. Make sure to turn them in if you would like to go. And now, now to your Bulldog Sports. I'm Goldman. And I'm Emma. And this, this is your Bulldog, Bulldog Sports. Seventh and eighth grade basketball had their tryouts. Let's go and interview with the eighth grade coach to see how practice is going so far. Are you excited for the new players on the team? Oh, yeah, I'm excited for the group of guys we got. We got a lot of guys that, uh, you know, really care about basketball. We've got big guys. We've got quick guys. We've got, you know, guys that can shoot, guys that can pass. We've got a lot of different options on how we can play basketball this year. But, you know, we want to make sure we're all playing hard and we're all focused being a good team. How do you feel like the season will go this year? Oh, I'm really excited. You know, we coached these guys last year. Um, you know, some games they didn't bring their best. Some games they, you know, you brought stuff that was maybe unexpected, but this year, you know, we're going to take it one game at a time, just do our best that game, learn from that game, and, you know, just see what happens at the end of the year. Once you get to, you know, the county tournament, anything can happen. So we're looking forward to it. It's going to be a great year. Thanks. Now to the interview with one of the players that made the team. How were tryouts? I think the tryouts were good. I think Coach picked the right people for the team. Is this your first season on the team? Yes, this is my first season. How do you think the season's going to go? I think the season will do good. We have a lot of potential. Thanks. Thanks. Open gym for girls basketball starts November 1st from 3 to 5 and November 9th from 5 to 7. Bulldog Hysteria is coming up November 2nd. Come support your Bulldogs. Saturday's forecast is a high of 44 and a low of 33. Sunday's forecast is a high of 46 and a low of 35. Uh, Halloween's forecast is a high of 49 and a low of 35. And now to your brain trainer. What is the most popular kind of candy sold at Halloween? Report your answers to Mr. Rutkin in room 220. Now to your flashback Friday. Thanks for watching. I hope everyone has a happy Halloween.